All right, the Slimith Mike uh, Scholarship Fund started back in 1981 at the University of Southern California, and it's worked its way south to the swimming pool at UCSD. The goal to get physically challenged athletes back in the game with a chance at a college education. As you can see, Swim with Mike is all about having fun in the pool and in the process, raising money to provide college scholarships for physically challenged athletes. These kids getting back into college uh, because we give scholarships to the applicants that we can um, are able to get back into the game. The Swimathon, which also resembles a pool party, is now in its 34th year with a goal of helping athletes who have suffered major injuries off the field with the goal of helping them overcome their tragedies. I went on a snowboarding trip to Utah and there I broke my neck. I sustained a C4-5 incomplete spinal cord injury. I had a stroke. That was caused uh, by an AVM. Hit a telephone pole and unfortunately wasn't wearing my seatbelt, so um, resulted in a T9 um, complete spinal cord injury. Mission Bay high grad Ryan Porteous is one of those athletes. He loves sailing on the water with the Mission Bay Yacht Club, but his life would take a drastic change in his freshman year at UC Santa Barbara. I broke my neck. I was uh, on a boat dock and uh, ended up slipping off the dock and ended up uh, hitting my head on the side of the dock going in the water and it um, broke C6 um, in my spinal cord and which caused uh, pretty much partial paralysis from the neck down. But despite the injury, Ryan has not let it stop him from competing in the sport he loves. The great thing is that once you leave the chair and you're out in the boat and you're sailing competing, then you totally forget about the, like your disability or any of that and it's the same sport again and it's out there competing against elite competition. With a lot of hard work, Ryan is now a member of the U.S. sailing team with his eye on the Paralympics. The competitive level is just the same. It's elite competition and uh, right now I'm on the U.S. sailing team so traveling around uh, competing against international competitors and other national competitors and um, it's definitely an elite level competition. So whether it's conquering challenges and getting back on the water or even walking again, Swim with Mike will allow these athletes to get back in the classroom and realize their full potential. It means a ton to me because it means that I get to go to school so much easier than I would otherwise. Definitely Swim with Mike would be huge if I get the scholarship to help out with going back to school and realizing all those goals that I had before I got hurt. I do plan to apply to medical school here in the next couple of years okay. and again to Swim with Mike right. um, to hopefully continue another after five years now, hopefully some more in the future to um, yeah, get a medical degree and hopefully practice medicine. And a big thanks goes to Betsy Thomas who was able to coordinate a satellite event at UCSD where last year they raised over $40,000. And we were fortunate enough to approach UCSD uh, from the very beginning and asked if they'd be willing to do this. Would they be willing to support our cause? Getting people out here to have some fun, feel like donating and just kind of celebrating just how special and unique that this program is and how wonderful and awesome these kids are. As for Betsy, she's so excited for the May 3rd event, she can't wait to get started. Swim with Mike, it's going to be a splash! All right, now Betsy insisted she was going to do a cannonball, but I give her a 10 for that dive. Well done, but uh, for a great cause there. Good job for uh, Betsy. All right, Swim with Mike will take place at the UCSD Swimming Pool on Saturday. That'll be on May 3rd.